Okay, Tito decided he wants to get in on the action. Say hi, everybody. My name's Tito. He's our little chihuahua. He's very unique. He's going to help me. So we're going to show some other horses that are not Myra. Sorry about that. I know everybody loves Myra. I love Myra. But I always have to offer a variety. And these are all going up on my website soon. Some of these might already be up there. This, as you can see, has a skull and a rose. But you can see these little skulls that are kind of carved in the leather. And you got your rivets and... Yeah. That's Tito. He's making noises. You can put your checkbook in there. There's quite a bit of room. And it's got the strap. So you can carry it like a purse if you want. Or you can carry it like a clutch as well. Like a clutch, you know. So you've got two strap options, I believe. Let's see here. Yeah, two strap options. That's pretty good. That's awesome. A lot of wallets you get don't have both but I'm very pleased with the quality of these in this company I can't wait to get out to do some events and see the response I'm gonna get with these these purses and wallets and such and then it's got the back it's got actually got a pocket in the back and then you got a, a little zipper pouch here to get that back in the package. I'll let Tito sit there a minute. What do you see? What do you see? If you really want a wallet and purse that match, there's this shoulder bag. I guess I'm not that picky. I don't have to have my wallet match my purse. I used to be like that. I don't know if it was when I was younger or if I just don't care anymore because <laughs> I'm older. I don't, know. I don't care about my purse and my wallet matching these days. That could be just me. But look at this. It's got two straps. And this, this is like a stitched skull with the rose. Two straps, close the shoulder bag. Yeah, this is this is gonna be a really good bag too. I mean, it's gonna I'm gonna get a good, it's gonna get a good response. I'm pretty sure with this bag. And these are not there's no there's no brand name for these, so I'm sorry I couldn't tell you the brand. A, that's that's a teal. I would call that teal, turquoise. Um, so many different names you could call that. That's got a lot of room in there. You could put your checkbook, debit cards. It's got the buckle in the front, but the buckle does not come undone. It's just for looks. You got your pocket in the back and your strap for carrying it. And butterflies are always popular, so I always think about what is popular and what's in demand and what people like when I'm placing orders. Um, so on my Facebook lives, I do the live and then I upload it. Where I see other people doing lives, they're actually live. Like they don't, I don't think they're uploading anything. I think you have to get to a certain point on Facebook Marketplace to get there. Um, for the more conservative ladies, we have these purses. Amen. There's these, I'm pretty sure, are genuine leather. They're really nice. If they're not genuine, they're really um, pretty darn close to it. And there's the strap that goes with it. Let's see, the strap actually connects like a belt. So you got the buckle, 
You actually have two buckles on each side. That's, that's a really cute purse. I didn't put it together, so sorry about that, but you get the idea. And that can be like a crossbody bag. It's not a real huge purse, but some women don't want a huge purse. some black as well. So, if you're interested in black, uh, I am winding down for the day. So, if, if I seem a little calm and cool collect, I'm just kind of running out of steam, but I still have to go walk my three, three and a half miles, which I will here in a little bit. And that's like a skull. What do you call that? So, it opens like that. That's the front. Kind of a western cowgirl. If I could set up at the Wapolo Rodeo, I might sell a few of these. I've never set up over there as a vendor. I should probably think about doing that. It's hard when you work full-time to spend your whole weekend somewhere selling stuff. Because, you know, you want to stay home and relax and not go anywhere sometimes, but, oh, that's neat. That's a cool, that's a cool color. I don't know whether to tell you it's blue or like an off gray. There's the turquoise stone in the middle there. This has got quite a bit of room. Lots of room. All that cash you're hauling around. It's got the two straps as well, where you can carry it as a wrist, wristlet or like a, like a purse, like a crossbody purse. You want to go down? Let's see. The other dog we have. So, North End Vintage, you can find me. If you look for, on eBay, North End and Vintage 68, I think is my name on there. If you have any trouble finding me out there, just send me a message. You can send it through Facebook. You can find me on Facebook, North End Vintage, um, Etsy. I'm trying to think what my name is on Etsy. I think it's just North End Vintage on Etsy. Sometimes when I, you know, when I choose North End Vintage, sometimes the name was taken, so I had to kind of alter the name. But... Um, I don't know if any of my local people have caught on to that I'm on here live showing purses yet, but maybe someday and maybe they'll say, hey, Raja, let's do a party. We'll do a purse party. This one's cool. Look at this. It's a backpack. That is definitely, definitely got to be real leather. I'm so pleased with the quality of these bags from this company. Oh my God, you could put all kinds of stuff in there. This would be a great stylish fat. It's got really long um, straps. You got a pocket in the back. A pocket, two pockets in the back. It'd be a good gym bag too. If you're going to the gym. A work bag. Put your work stuff in it. You could fit your laptop in that too. My Chromebook would definitely fit in there. Plus, plus more. More room. <sighs> Sorry. Hi. I'm tired. What can I say? I'm tired. A little bit tired today, so I'm quieter than I am. I'm going to see if there's a chat thing. I hope I don't mess it up. I'm going to say hello. people watching. That's good. Let me know if you're local, if you're watching. Or somewhat local. Again, I'm in southeast Iowa. Oh, this one's neat. Love this. I like the fringe that's just kind of, it's kind of asymmetrical. Really neat. You know, you see purses like this in the buckle. If you ever shop at the buckle, 
they have neat western stuff in there and bags and stuff. I'm not saying go to the buckle. Look me up. All these should be, like I said, all these bags I'm showing should be up on my stores if you're not local and you like to order. If you're in the U.S. and I ship, you order, they you order something tonight, I'm getting it ready to ship tomorrow and it'll be out in the mail tomorrow and usually people will get them one or two days after they order. Because I know when I order stuff, I like to get it fast, so I try to be a fast shipper. This matches... That purse, we just showed you the. If you're, if you're into the matching wallet and purse thing, I'm not. I'm not. I, I can remember when I was like that. When was it? What was I in my 20s? Now I'm in my 50s. Don't care if my purse matches my wallet. <laughs> Is anybody else like that? When you were younger, you wanted your purse and wallet to match, and now you don't care. No judgment. If you don't judge me, I won't judge you. <laughs> I'm kidding. That one's purple. I think I showed that the other night. It's got the butterflies. I'm just going to set this stuff out here. And if you're into red, I get a lot of um, requests for red. That's really neat. This one, if, it, if this one had a name, I think it should be called Jolene. It reminds me of that song. Just kind of. I don't know. Um, and that one's kind of cool, too. They're all really neat. I haven't picked one of these out for myself yet. I'm still carrying my Myra, Myra bag, Myra wallet. But I know I showed that one the other night. Anybody have any questions out there? Karen Truck. Your name sounds familiar. You, I think you're local. You're somewhat local. Thanks for stopping by. Oh, that one's cute. I love that one. And this one, it's got like all kinds of colors, all kinds of things going on there. It's got the double strap too. It's got the little wristlet strap. And so the next event I'm doing, like I said, is a SAS farm. I think that's up by Hills, Iowa, or Riverside. It's in, excuse me, in two weeks. See, this week is e in, wait, weekend's Easter already. Can you believe that? Doesn't it feel like it was just Christmas? So we're getting together with the family Sunday. And then the following weekend... That's the Sass Family Farm. I want to say it's the 15th. That one's so awesome. My God. I just can't tell you how awesome these wallets and these purses are that I got. And I've got a lot, so I don't think I'll be showing all of them tonight, but you'll get the idea. And that's Tito out there barking. I like when he was in here with me. And he's in here. So there's the same wallets, but kind of just different colors and different versions of them that I got because some people want, you know, maybe want black, some people want red, or there's the butterfly, but it's brown. If you don't like the purple, I have different colors of the butterfly. So here was the purple, here's the brown. <clears throat> we have a lot of friends and want to get together and they love purses. We want to get together and have a party. We can even do a fundraiser. I've done that before with my jewelry and I always have a really good response with those. This is like a crossbody. Same version of the wallet and the backpack bag. Yeah, this company doesn't disappoint with the bags that they're manufacturing. One thing is, I've noticed with this company, when I'm seeing them on the website to order them wholesale, 
they are disappearing fast. So I think they sell out of stuff fast. So I'm not trying to make a sale, but if you see something you like and you really like it and you really want it, you better get it. I, I ordered this. I actually have a bag that I made like this. I put a stencil on it. It's a smaller burlap bag, but I wanted to try to see what these totes, how they would go over at shows. And I'm telling you, I put a chick on, chicken on anything and people love it. They're cute. Everybody loves chicken. Anybody out there raise chickens? I know a lot of people around here raise chickens. Price of eggs, I can see why. This one's cute. Oh, this one's really cute. This is a smaller, um, I would almost wallet size crossbody. That's a really neat, that's a really neat bag. Really cute. Hmm, and it's got the, this is the strap for it. Yeah, that one's, hmm. I'm sorry I'm not telling you prices because I don't know prices off. The top of my head but like I said they're on my site if you see them on my site say you see a bag on my site and say it's $25 um, in person it's not going to be 25 it's going to be less because again I'm accommodating for the fees online and then you're not paying shipping of course <clears throat> so so I'm doing SAS Family Farm on 15 the weekend after that I have my calendar here. Where did it go? Oh, it's over there. I don't want to go get it. Anyhow, I know on the 29th I'm doing, I think that's the United Township in East Moline. That's a huge craft show. Oh my gosh, they have tons of vendors. So if you can get to East Moline on the uh, 29th, oh, I hope that's not the wrong date. So, um, you can look it up though, the events on Facebook. United Township, UTHS in each East Moline the craft show. Um... So that's going to be a really good event. And then the day after that, I'm in Dubuque for another really awesome event. If you want to get to Dubuque, Iowa, it's called the She Shed. And oh, they're having a, a special where you can pay a little extra to get in early. I would do that. I would suggest highly doing that if you can. Pay the extra to get in to see these awesome vendors. They got vendors that come from all over the Midwest and to bring their merchandise to this place in Dubuque. It's at the, the Dubuque County Fairgrounds, April 30th. And usually they start around, I want to say 10 or 11 a.m. and go until about 3. But I'll be a vendor there. I'm so fortunate and so grateful that I'm going to be a vendor there. Jody and KT put on these awesome events. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Boo. <laughs> it's skulls. It's got all these skulls. Not a bag for me, but... I do have a lot of customers that will just love this bag. This is like a, I might, hey, my Chromebook might fit in that too. Um, yeah, if you're a badass chick, you're going to want this bag. Maybe it shows better there. Sorry about the video being like sideways like it is. I don't know how to do it the other way and I don't, technology is not my friend. But this bag holds quite a bit. A lot of compartments and you got one in the back here and this I'm telling you the quality of these you know sometimes you see these bags or you order them and they look cheap or you think they feel cheap these totally are not like that they are they don't feel cheap so yeah yeah that's gonna be that's gonna be a really good seller so I'm so glad you guys stopped by and watching and hanging out with me on a Monday. I need to get off here so I can go do some crafting and walking and exercising. I'll show you one more. Another skull. I try to have a variety of styles, so... So, I accommodate customers, but... um. I have so many different styles. I'm sure if you don't like a bag that you're seeing tonight, I have something that you would like. But yeah, that's another. Ooh, 
Wow, really good quality. This is really nice, well made. It's like a, what you call that, bronze looking. Bronzy, brown, I call it brown, but it's kind of shimmery, shiny. Oh, back in the day, I don't think I would have, I don't, I don't know, I probably never would have had a skull purse. That's just not me, but, um, no, there, it's really neat. If I saw a woman carrying a purse like that, I would compliment it and say that's a cool purse, but it's just not something I would carry. Uh, maybe someday. So anyhow, guys, thank you so much, and leave me a comment. I'm going to upload this, these two videos to YouTube. If you didn't see my other video, I did a video a little bit ago with the pouches, a, bun a bunch of Myra pouches that I have on hand. So, thank you so much. Everybody have a good night. Wonderful weekend. I'll try to do another live sometime by the end of the week. Bye-bye.